Hello, the internet, and welcome back to Patch Note 21 of Slay the Spire. This got released about five hours ago. Yeah, I was away from my computer. I just saw it and I was like, oh no. But yeah, Patch 21, let's get into it. So, what they did is what could these all be? Oh, interesting, new orbs. Oh. There seem to be like buff orbs or some debuff orbs. I don't know. Balances. Anger cards damage buffed by one. Anger? Ooh. That'll be pretty cool. Clipping poison rework. Apply four. Seven poison. Uh, I think four is the base and seven is the upgrade. I think so. And two weak to all enemies. Exhaust. Okay. Crippling poison is the exhaust card now. Right. Feel no pain card nerf. Ah. Uh, that's ironclad, I think. It got nerfed from 4 to 3 blocks, and the upgrade got nerfed from 6 to 5, so 1 point nerf, pretty much. Um, next one, Immolate Card Buff. It adds a burn card to discard pile instead of draw pile now. Okay, so yeah, that's more understandable. Immolate Card Buff, it's doing 21 damage instead of 18, so that's a buff of 3 damage to all enemies. Mm, that's pretty good. Immolate Plus is a plus four damage buff. That's pretty huge. Seven damage up when you upgrade it. Okay. Okay, Jack's dealer event cost of Jack's updated from 100 to 77. So Jack's is a. It's like those dealers that show up saying, hey, you want to get Jack's? So when, when you use that card, you get two or three strength. It costs zero? I think zero energy, yes. But. It gives you two or three strengths, I can't remember, but then it exhausts itself. It's like a power card that exhausts. So, yeah. For instance, it usually costs 100 gold, now they put it down to 77. Next one is Reckless Charge, which now... It gives you a Daze card, I think? Yeah. And it is now uncommon as well. And they nerfed the plus... The upgraded version of Reckless Charge by... A, Nerf damage by one, so one damage is reduced. And sneaky strike card buff. I think that's silence. I'm not sure. It got buffed to 10 damage from 8 base, and the upgraded version is 14 damage from 12. And next one is wild strike card is now common. Bug fixes, they added in adding a phone to. That's my phone. Okay. Adding Ostrophoe to. Pandora box, okay. Uh, Ascender's Bane was used using the wrong software using causing data on upload issues, okay. Byte now correctly works when last hitting in fast mode. Okay, Calling Bell no can no longer give multiple campfire option relics. Oh, it can only give one now? Ah, oh, that, that, I never heard that case. That, that is pretty broken. If that, that, if that was happening a lot. Curses that Pilot receives are now seeded. Okay. I don't get that much. Falling event now correctly. I think it shows in the seed. Yeah. Falling event now correctly previews upgraded cards. Falling events. RNG is now seeded. Okay. Yeah. Seeded. They fix bugs where Oricalcom relics never stopped flashing. Was that a case? I never know. It's barely noticeable. Fixed crashes when traveling to a new room while a bottle relic screen was open. Whoa. I feel sorry for those people. Fixed issues where aw awakened one could grow multiple times. Yeah. Yeah, it could. I remember that happening once. Um, Jimlin... Jim Lin, leaders, minion, summon are now seeded. Okay. So is the seeded is as a database, I guess. Yeah. Just telling. Uh, match and keep event is now seeded. Okay. Membership card relic is no longer incorrectly lowers. Question mark. Room chances. Oh, it's just like in it was incorrectly lowering it. Okay. Obtaining a bottle relic no longer removes other relics in the reward screen and chest. Okay. Patch note screen can scroll to the bottom now. Oh. 
I barely use the Pasino screens. I use I use Steam because it's more easy. Um, what else? What else? What else? Uh, where was I? I lost myself. Saving and returning to the main menu on a boss now properly silences the boss BGM. Okay. Which main? Ah, oh, so probably the BGM is still going. Okay. Saving improved so far as I saved more constant consistently for slower hard drives, sensory stone, event, warning fix, okay. Shine, shiny daily mod no longer has card upgrading related bugs, okay. Shiny daily mod now correctly marks cards as seen, no longer shows question marks cards, da da da. Thorns now correctly works when killing the spiker as the last enemy in fast mode, okay. Delay loading Delay loading run history data until the screen is open. They delay the loading of run history. Okay. Fix several shop screen assets that caused memory leak. Yeah, that was happening to me once or twice. But it wasn't that much of a huge deal for me. Seeds are now utilized for gold rewards from events, chests, and various rooms. Seeds now have da 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 for many enemies. Actions that are unseated randomness. Yeah, those are all C's utility utilized for da -da -da. UI effects. They added a disclaimer for daily climb that achievements are disabled. They added another disclaimer for seated runs that achievements and leaderboards are disabled. So that's kind of cool. So people will now know that choosing one of those modes will tell them that this the, the following things will be disabled if you do this mode. That's kind of neat. Uh, card quick select now deselects hovered card on double tap. Oh, so if you double tap the same number, deselect it. Ah, huh. yeah, that's good. That's helpful, I guess. Cursed keys now pulses when you are in the chest room. Oh, oh, so it shows that the, that the cursed keys in effect if you do some if you're going in a. If you're in the room, the chest room. Language drop down menu now has a larger, larger max. What? Language, language drop down menu ha now has a larger max. What What do you mean by larger max? Larger language. I'm guessing. Pickup versus pickup warding consists. Are they fixed the uh, pickup versus pickup warding? Consist consistency okay question cards indicates that it works on future card rewards as it no longer it's no longer a boss relic okay scroll bars have been added to the ma many screens many screens updated art for card removal service at shops okay localization they added new languages um yeah they you can see it here so they added new languages i should really look at my obs instead of my screen so i can tell if you guys are actually getting the looks okay there's support for custom capitalization on card key keywords for f for french um, updated for f holy moly japan um france french france i don't know um, russia holy moly these are like different languages Several images in the shop are now localized for ZHS. Da, da, da. Yeah, cleaning up white space and tabs for English for file formatting. Thanks to Vlad. Thanks, Vlad. Um, that's about it. So, thing that cu I'm very curious about. See stuff. These three balls. What could these all be? Well, I know what they are. They're for that mage guy. Is the mage guy out yet? Oh, I stopped playing God of War for this. I'm curious now. Oh. Thank you for watching this video. Like if you liked it, dislike if you disliked it, and subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. God of War.